how many, how, how many yeah, go ahead. Oh, yeah, okay. so, so just to give us your perspective on, you know, to move out in the field, we talked about a thousand measurements. Mm -hmm. um, what do you think and, you know, what might you want to use the PhotoSync okay, sure. setup for? Uh, so, yeah, um, let me introduce myself. Sure, My yeah. name is Ali Soltani and uh, I'm working here as a uh, postdoc in a breeding program, breeding, uh, bean breeding and genetic program. So uh, for Mm, the, the measurement that we took today is a uh, very user-friendly kind of uh, easy data to, uh, to, to take the measurement and uh, we hopefully can uh, somehow relate these measurements that we got today in the field uh, correlated with the yield which is the end product and the quality of the um, crops that we can get and uh, yeah that would be a very um, applicable in terms of the uh, breeding and you guys do yeah. genetic mapping so it, yes, hopefully we can yes, do the yes, phenotypes can, straight down to the genotype in this way, yes we can um, do the phenotyping very easily in the, in, the, the, in the field or in the greenhouse and we are taking care of the, the genetic part of that we are doing that situation mapping to find the, which genes are involved in that uh, photosynthesis efficiency which yeah. genes are involved in Traits that are related to the photosynthesis. Yeah. Well, next time we'll we'll do a field that's like five minutes instead of an that hour and a half cool. from that. The... <laughs> but North Dakota is a big state. Yeah. So. Okay, that cool. Would be cool. Yeah. All right. mm -hmm. Well, thanks. Mm -hmm.